friends, I'm Ava. And I'm Javier, here on Thursday, November 7th. Today we have Caleb with your sports report and also with this week's weather. Now please stand for the pledges. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Please remain standing for the Texas Pledge. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to the Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. And now, please remain standing for a moment of silence. According today to the Associated Press, after Tuesday's presidential election, Donald Trump is projected to win the Electoral College and the projected president-elect of the United States. To add on to this, Ted Cruz is projected to keep his seat in the Senate. Speaking of Texas, voters in Frisco have rejected new bond proposals that would have helped fund schools in the new school district. In local news, a community-driven Frisco ISD committee has proposed six legislative op op priorities for the 2025 Texas Legislative Session. The 120 Legislative Leadership Committee represents our entire district and includes teachers, staff, community members, and students. These priorities will help direct efforts in the upcoming 89th Texas Legislature. Attention Titans, the DECA School Store is now open in A102 from 8.30 to 8.58 a.m., offering snacks, drinks, and spirit wear. They've also launched an online store featuring new bucket hats, water bottles, and pajama pants. Visit A102 to try on sizes. Centennial Hosa is partnering with Carter Blood Care for an upcoming blood drive on November 14th. If you're interested in donating, you must be at least 16 years old, weigh 110 pounds, and bring a photo ID. Seniors, remember, you can earn a red cord at graduating by donating twice this year. Let's show our Titan spirit. We're participating in Toys for Tots, collecting new unwrapped toys today through November 8th. We're competing against other FISD schools and McKinney ISD, so bring your donations to tonight's varsity football game or campus collection points. Time for your weekly sports update, Titans. Tonight we have a varsity football team taking on Heritage at Toyota Stadium at 7 p.m. In basketball news, our varsity boys will be facing Midlothian tomorrow, tomorrow night at Midlothian High School. Also, our girls golf team is competing at the state tournament in Georgetown today and tomorrow. Good luck to all our athletes. <laughs> Look at your weather forecast. Today we're expecting moderate rains with a high of 74 and a low of 55. Tomorrow's misty conditions will bring a high of 78 and a low of 66. Friday's heavy rain conditions continues the wet pattern. But the weekend brings relief with sunny skies both Saturday and Sunday. Keep those umbrellas handy for the next few days, Titans. Thank you for watching our Titan newscast. Make it a great day, Titans.